Nova Cannon shot on Chris. Prasad's going in for a ram on Tiberius. Oh, they caught zero. Zero came back in. I don't imagine he'll be long for this world. 64% and falling. So first blood to go to chaos, but so he's gonna be following pretty close behind, probably. Views with the background of the white tank. <laughs> Prasans took a hit from a bunch of uh, Thanatos and it just rolled him, so he flipped back. <laughs> what? I don't know. You did this in our fight. Otto, <laughs> why wait. didn't you learn? <laughs> why didn't you dodge? Yeah, he's getting out of there. He's trying to get back to the rest of his team. But we have almost every faction included in that. We got it on the docket today. It will be a double elimination tournament. Not quite competitive, but there's a bit of structure to it. For the All right. emperor. All right. Let's see how the sin speed holds up. Let's look. At, let's look. It's 1.0, let's go! 1.0, 1.0. Dark Raid Supreme, boys, we did it. 8v8, 1.0, what's the problem? <laughs> All right, it looks like we have Chaos splitting into two teams. One to the left, one to the right. Looks like that's the general plan of the Imperials as well. Leaving the center open. Nobody wants to get in there and get caught between two fleets. Yeah. Means we're gonna see some clashes on those sides. Zero's not moving yet. Hopefully he can get his butt in his seat. It is actually just my frame rate, my personal frame rate, because I'm streaming that is tanking. Like some weaker systems might also be tanking, but the game is running at 1.0. The server at least. Yeah. The important part is one at 1.0. <laughs> Chaos consumes us. That's right. Gonna turn off the tracker for a while. Oh yeah, we don't while really we start. need to see the tracker, so I'm gonna change <laughs> the tickets to how many did you say? Just add a thousand. Okay, so two two five zero. That should be good. There we go. Tickets have been increased. Dark Star Witchcraft. Right. Yeah, there's been a lot of witchcraft around here. Top-down views with the background of the white planet are nice. Yeah. <laughs> Prasans took a hit from a bunch of uh, Thanatos and it just rolled him, so he flipped back. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like 303, popping up the tracker. 1% shields, trying to get out of there. Getting tagged by some fixed weapons from the Slaneshi cruisers. As Otto tees off on his own against three grids. Uh, I don't know, you did this in our fight. <laughs> Otto, why wait. didn't you learn? <laughs> why didn't you dodge? Yeah, he's getting out of there. He's trying to get back to the rest of his team. Turn off the sphere visuals for better clarity here. These slow imperial cruisers try to get get their way into uh, into range. Max trying to manually fire Thanatos at this range. See him, admin, he's doing it sideways. Yeah, the majority of the Imperial fleet appears to be holding a decent formation here between the roids and the center. Yep, it looks like they're giving up the right. They have stopped pursuing that and are all collapsing on these three chaos cruisers on the left. Zero zipping in to join them now that he's got control of his grid. Come on, camera. <laughs> Work with me here. My inputs are just ever so slightly <laughs> delayed. Muscle memory's failing. <laughs> so now that the uh, the fight's actually gone, yeah. Client sim almost dipping down to point eight somewhere around there. Yeah, definitely going to be seeing some client speed reduction, but the server's just fine. Yeah, we got all of the Imperials engaging these four Chaos Grids on the uh, on the far cap. It uh, It's not going to go too well for them if they stick around here, but if they can hold them off long enough for the rest of the Chaos Fleet to take the center zone, then it'll be worth it. Are tickets ticking? Did they capture? Uh, no, there has been no are captures this far. Are they backwards on names? <laughs> Chaos is red. 
Yeah, I just punch split. it in again. Hopefully it starts going. It is a 30 second uh, capper. Yeah. Chaos, yeah. Should have capped that far zone by now. I just set the teams again for the both of them. And yeah, it's CHR. Oh, fuck. <sighs> That's on me. Oops. That's a big whoops on me. I confused the uh, Space Engineers R with an A because uh, the font is really good. Gotcha. I that, see an abandoned um, chaos grid over here. I'm going to get in it and park it in this cap zone for them, at least. All right. Bryce. Is Bryce in it? Bryce having issues? like uh, Pinhead has gotten caught out. He's in trouble. There. I just added 250 tickets to Chaos. Perfect. Kind of make up for the little whoops there. The, the warp storm ate the, the cap zone, sorry. Ooh. Wow. Squishy is beat up. All right, we're going to... The Imperials have been in that zone for quite a while, haven't they? Oh, there they go. So capping does work. It's just... The name was wrong. The briefly. name was wrong. That, yep, that's on and me. Pinhead goes red. I'm and Pinhead's gone red. Move this chaos grid. Let's see if it. The majority of the Imperials have concentrated into the zone on their far left. The Chaos ship's taking the long way around. Go. Chaos own that far zone, or uh, Imperials own that far zone, but. Back to the action here. Zero now. Well, in range of the entire Imperial squadron. Under the gun. Yeah, there they go. I don't think we need to do it right now, do we? If this was for an actual tournament, yeah. This is just a show match. This is just a show tournament, in yeah. honesty. I barely call it a tournament. I just set up the bracket so that we could get as many fights in with various grids against various teams as possible. Yeah. Chaos has two points now. And they have a kill. Yep. And they did Chaos get the 250 points on top just for losing out on those caps. So, yep. they will be in the advantage. Zero lived. Got out of dodge. Auto under fire. Getting swarmed by those uh, Tyranid drones, or those Nurgle drones. Oh! Getting rammed by Lego Master. Otto is having a time of it. Oh no, he is just surrounded by these little Tyranid hive abominations. Yeah, and there he goes, cut in half. Pulled apart and surrounded by the chaos. Who picked up some Tyranids on the side of the road. <laughs> they're just, they're, they're nurglings, it's fine. Oh, they caught zero, zero came back in. Don't imagine he'll be long for this world. 64% and falling. So 
So first blood to go to chaos, but Zero's gonna be following pretty close behind, probably. Ooh. Yeah, he just What's lost his nose there, a big chunk fell off. Pretty sure that Nova Cannon just overpinned. Ooh. I thought they were contact shoes. <laughs> they, they also deal a fair bit on uh, impact. Oh, okay. Must have just gone through some light armor then. I'm sure it just went through light, yeah. Yeah, I was in control of the center's cap now as uh, the Imperials move to the side and are now spreading way out. Yeah, the custom damage smoke definitely helping quite a bit with the spectacle as Tiberius is now <laughs> being screamed at by crabs. <laughs> back in the zone, wondering if he's still in. Starting to wonder if Chaos actually needed that 250 tickets. Right. They're, uh, managing to turn this around. Oh, I'll still let him have it. I do wonder how many of the players actually saw that I gave Chaos 250 tickets because of that chat thing, where players don't actually receive chat messages at the server's uh. point. Or if their client connection is busy. I'm getting screamed at by Chris. <laughs> no cannon shot on Chris. Prasan's going in for a ram on Tiberius. He might actually split him in half! Just oh, about man. did. Tiberius looking rough in that Armageddon. Most of his weapon banks, the Thanatos, have been destroyed. Almost all of the slingers are gone. All of the slingers are gone. <laughs> Just a couple Gladius and Thanatos left on this thing. It is built pretty tough. Not counted out so fast. He's hanging in there. He's got support from Max here. Yeah, and this is exactly the kind of fight that Chaos wanted. As Tiberius has actually gone red. There he goes. So out of two dead ships on the field so far, both of them belong. To the Imperials. I believe, Orpheus uh, under fire, 50%, looking pretty rough. <laughs> Just got some Acers left, his fi we fixed weapon bank is gone. Bryce has been out of the action for the entire match as he's been trying to rejoin in the middle of the action. Yeah, I parked his grid over there in the uh, other cap. Star Knight looking to finish off Orpheus here as he tries to fly in and assist Squidopolis. It's surprising how maneuverable Orpheus is after taking all that damage. Or is he just flinging himself with that much control? No, he has an after <laughs> Two of them. Oh yeah, he can really move and uh, Chet's ready for him though. Yep, taking some fire from Chet and Star Knight trying to finish him off. Here comes He's Bryce. moving fast now. Alright, I gotta turn off these names, it's getting a bit dense. <laughs> well, now I don't know what to... Who to call out. <laughs> Damn it. I do need the name. <laughs> <laughs> Jed is a brand new player after uh, not playing Space Engineers for a very long time. This is some of his first gameplay. <laughs> I wonder how he feels about it. And we are happy to have him. Yeah. As he... Pours that fire from that Nurgle vessel onto Max. His fortification's about to drop. Max sitting there at 73%. Big grid. Another launch of uh, strike craft. Nurgle strike craft. After Max. 
Do you figure they have to pay like licensing rights to the Tyranids or? <laughs> Does Zinch just drop them a 50 every now and then? You know, I never thought about how uh, how Chaos feel about Tyranids. Uh, don't they create a shout in the warp wherever they go? Yeah. I figure they'd probably be pretty displeased about them. <laughs> what sin speed doing? Uh, my local sin speed, it's it's bouncing up and down. Uh, but the service sin speed, still at 1-0. This is running so well, I agree. Oh, Max Flying Cat down! Max down! Wow, what a turnaround from the start of the match. Well, I think, uh... That's Bryce... a Nova Cannon, fire and miss after MTD. Ah, oh, dang. I think Bryce hanging out away from the action of the whole match and coming in as reinforcements after might have been decisive. Where is Bryce? I don't see him. There he is. Putting some long range fire onto Squidopolis. Squidopolis not long for this world now. They put a lot of damage on the Chaos team, but those grids just did die. Imps have PD. It's just, uh, whenever we look at a grid getting picked apart by the drones, it's usually a grid that has been already pretty damaged, and thus has uh, lost a lot of its point defense. Yeah, the Imps and uh, Mechanicus all have a smattering of Heimdalls, so... Yeah, that should be alright. Starnite now standing alone against Prasans, MTD, Lego Master, All Bryce. All capture zones decapped, thanks to Chris Panth <laughs> over on the far side. Looks like they're trying to go for his drive cluster and they have succeeded in ripping out what was in there. Chaos now control of zone 2 again. But with 303 and Chet remaining. I don't see this uh, turning Imperial's way. Oh, a Thanatos volley out for zero. Maybe it can finish him off. Oh! Yeah, now this is looking like a pretty solid Chaos victory. And I don't think changing their tickets made a damn difference at all. No. <laughs> Being down a player didn't uh, didn't slow him down either. Bryce disconnecting at the beginning. Yeah. Chaos were also down a grid for the entire match. Perfect calling on the tickets. Yep. Please nerf Chaos. Sexy time evil of me. <laughs> oh, I don't know if, uh, if that was correct. We could have gone down in the tickets since it's apparently still going to take uh... Chaos, 10 minutes to win on Ticket Bleed, With and one, there are 3 minutes left in the match. One cap. There is 6 minutes and 20 on my screen. Ah, that's just desync for me then. Yeah. Yeah. So it was pretty close on time. That's very awkward for this kind of fight. Oh well. It was great to see. Yeah, those broadsides are always going to be awkward. The the Chaos have a profile that you can actually manage to get all guns on target. They're turrets with a wider range of motion. Whereas, you know, Imperials are a little hampered by the fact that they're a broadside. And that's game. Chet finally is cut down. That is 100% KO victory for Chaos. Oh. Not sure what's going on there, but whatever. 